my name is a terabyte and welcome back to my bedroom i guess <laughs> yeah um so today i wanted to basically make a video on the samsung odyssey neo g9 versus the samsung odyssey g9 from 2020 so last year's model versus this year's model and last the last video i made actually got a lot of dislikes so it made me feel a bit uh <laughs> made me feel a bit like insecure and disheartened and unconfident so I was a little bummed out but I decided to make this video because I was really excited to make this video and even though it might not be helpful to anybody maybe the few people it helps it'll be worth it and I guess I'm making these videos for myself and those few people so Let's do this. <laughs> Anyways, so um, the biggest thing I noticed with the Samsung Neo G9 versus the Samsung G9 is the backlighting. Of course, the new Samsung Neo G9 has the mini LED backlight, so it does get darker blacks and brighter brights. But I didn't really notice the difference until I saw them side by side. So I have been using the Samsung odyssey g9 for a few days now not too long to be honest and i never actually um noticed the backlighting too much actually i guess i really never noticed it at all but once i put the samsung neo g9 above it <laughs> the difference was the difference side by side seeing both of them together was kind of tremendous um as you can see the top Neo G9 has almost little to no backlight whatsoever when it is on a dark or black screen. However, the Samsung G9 has a lot of backlight. Like I said, when I was using this monitor, I never actually really noticed it sitting in front of it. So I guess you either get used to it or you don't really notice unless you have the two monitors side by side like I do. Um, other than that, I noticed the brights are very bright. Um, I have very sensitive eyes, so I usually tend to put my monitors on eye saver mode when I'm not playing video games. So for me, um, I don't have it always on the brightest setting. It starts to hurt my head. <laughs> it starts to give me headaches after a while, um, which may reminds me I really need to buy some like blue light glasses, anti anti blue light glasses. Maybe it will help a lot. Anyways. That is what I've noticed um, with these two monitors. This is definitely only going to be a temporary setup. Um, for me personally, when it comes to streaming, I like having the 27 inch monitor on top, uh, mostly because I can put my camera right here. I, I can't put my camera up there because of the other monitor, but normally I'd have my camera on the, um, the left side of my monitor and then I would have my mic on the right side of the monitor uh, but with two Odyssey G9s um, it is impossible to have my mic or camera up there for when I'm streaming so it doesn't really work for me I did want to set it up just to show you guys because I thought it would be super cool and I think it looks super duper cool but yeah this is just a short video if you have any more questions, please let me know and I'd love to test anything out for you that I can. It definitely looks super awesome and yeah, I hope to get to see you guys in another video. If you like this video, please give it a like. It really motivates me to make more. And if you hate this video, please comment and tell me what I can improve because I'm kind of new and yeah, I would love the feedback. It would really mean a lot to me. But yeah, have a wonderful day you guys and goodbye!